fucking loud? I'm in high school. <laughs> this is for the other kids. Okay. This one's for me. Good. You throwing them all down? Come on. I, like it. Okay. I guess it's a game. She throws all the ones she does not like. So this came in the mail yesterday. We actually got two of them and I'm so excited about it. They are noise canceling ear protection. And when you put them on, it's so good. And I love it. Do you want to try it? Uh -huh. Oh, Nanny wants to try it too. We weren't sure if they would fit this little head. What's going on? Hey, Nene. She's like still, what's different? You know, something's different. I can't hear anything. You can hear people talking, but it cuts out all ambient noise. Well, and it's quieter. It's quiet. Mm. We got two pairs. Because we have five kids. <laughs> Laura, can you hear me? Yeah, but quiet. Wow, you're being really loud. Hey! <laughs> Am I talking loud? Is it quiet? <laughs> like it? So we got these because a couple of our kids are kind of sensitive to loud sounds like fireworks. And I was thinking ahead to our summer plans and I was like, mm, let's just buy some ear coverings so it won't be so scary for them. And turns out we got them and I tried them on and I'm completely in love with them. For you? For me. I think maybe we just all need a pair and we'll all wear them all the time. Can you hear the music? <laughs> Everything's so quiet. Isaac is taking a break from the third Harry Potter. Constantly reading. This might be good for reading, Isaac. Especially at our house. We have a lot of noise going on. What? <laughs> Enjoy your book. We've joked about getting a soundproof room, but I think this might be a cheaper and better option. I'm in high school. College. Yeah, college. Wow, that's exciting. Where are you guys headed? We're going on a camping trip. You two are? Mm-hmm. Going at the ball at 3 a.m. There's a ball at 3 a.m.? Um, that's what my mom told us. Oh. Told me, basically. So you're going camping? Yeah. In those yeah. shoes? No, we just need them. For the ball? Yeah, for the ball today. Every day we have to go to the ball over and over and over. What are you going to do on your camping trip? Well, we're going to set up the campfire. We have to get ready though. Yeah. Have fun on your trip. So we've been living for a couple weeks without the handle. I haven't had a tool to screw it in. That's how it screws in right there to tighten. I'm going to try tweezers. I'm just getting sick of not having a handle. All right. I think that worked. Hopefully it'll stay. I don't know. It's not as tight as I want it to be. Oh, you're looking good. The handle's on though. Yeah, but then the kids like yank on it or climb on it or do ballet with it and it comes off. Good job. Thanks. Calling this one a win. It's only a matter of time. You guys doing some yoga? He's read another one. Yeah. Which one's your favorite so far of one, two, or three? I like number three. I like how much they reveal. They reveal. And I like the martyr to map. If only it was real. It shows wherever people are and like secret passageways in and out of Hogwarts. I have to make a campfire. I marked the place I'm going to cut this tree down. You're going to cut the tree down with a screwdriver? Mm -hmm. well, have fun. So Elise told me that she wants to sew more this summer. So we decided to bust out the sewing machine and she's going to try to make a bag. I think this one's going to work. You think so? But the only problem is, since it's pink, Laura might want to use it. Well, maybe you'll just have to make her one too. Yeah. 
So Lisey, we're not gonna start with making a bag that big. We have to start with a smaller bag. With this? What? Yeah, I think I that's about it? the perfect size. That's like your favorite color. What are you guys doing? Making a bag? Yeah! You want me to make you one? Yeah! I want it to be this one. That one? Yeah. Okay. You know your sister so well. So we've got this book, Sewing School, so I told her to pick a project out of here, and she's doing the Draw It Up Tote. So I want you to read it all the way through, Lisey, both pages before you do anything, okay? Just like a recipe, Lisey, you always wanna read it from beginning to end before you start. Okay. What are you guys doing? We're going camping. I'm okay. You okay? Let me see. You okay? You are a tough little cookie. For pretending that Cam's my dad. He's the oh. prince and I'm the princess. You are a tough girl. I'm a tough cookie. So you're gonna turn it all the way inside out. Like this? Yep, like that. So the pretty sides are together. I asked a bunch of friends for book recommendations and now I'm getting them and writing them down. Are you making a list? Mm -hmm. Of what they're saying? Mm -hmm. The Ballingers gave us a long one. Nice. I'm excited. Is this your first time threading the machine? Mm -hmm. It goes over here. Do you see that? Oh. Now you put this through the tip of the needle. Oh, I did it! Good job. So the bobbin's already there, so we just have to connect them. So here, plug it in. Plug in all that oh. stuff and we'll do the next step. You're doing great, Lacey. So now we're gonna take this, it goes down. Now the machine is threaded, so we don't wanna sew the ends. So then you always wanna have this right here. Under there. There we go. So now sew forward. And remember how to do reverse. I'm getting the hang of it. Today feels very summery. Isaac's working on his project, Elise is working on her project, Caleb and Laura are just outside playing and having fun, and Janae's napping, which feels very nice. Good job. She sews. Okay, next step is gonna be to trim those and flip it inside out. For a very little baby-sized pillowcase. That's how you make a pillowcase. Yep, but you so. don't bend the things. Now push it all the way through there. Nice. So then we just have to put it through the other side. You can wear it like a little purse. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna put in it? Gum. Gum, the most important thing to have in a purse. Are you happy with that? Mm -hmm. She's filled it up with her treasures. I'm really glad that Elise and I got to sew today. I've honestly been procrastinating it a little bit because I was intimidated by it. I felt like it was gonna make a big mess and take forever and be frustrating. But it wasn't. It actually was really easy, simple cleanup, and I think that only took 30 or 45 minutes to make the bag together. So it was a good reminder to me that I want to say yes more and just make stuff happen. You guys making a hot tub? Yeah. yeah. Ooh, this is warm. I'm just gonna relax over this. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> That's where I say, I say, oh yeah. When I say, oh yeah. Oh, sing it in the pool. Yeah, sing it in the pool. First popsicles of summer. Is today summer? It is, it's summer now. You look like you have lipstick on. <laughs> she wants me to read to her, but she doesn't want me to hold the book or turn the pages. She wants to be in charge. Yeah. I wonder where she got that from. <laughs> Ever since I was a teeny tiny baby crocodile, it's been my favorite. Chump, sloop, chump. I like it for breakfast, I like it for lunch, I like C is for cowboy. D is for diver. Well, see you later. I got my book. Let me see. Will you read me this book? Sure. Soon I'll have vines coming out my ears. 
So I discovered that there was a part that was longer that she was bored of. And so she wanted to get to certain parts. <gasps> what if I'm a fruit salad? Somebody, please help! I will never eat a watermelon again. No, never. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Caleb loves these cups. He's always doing different creative things Mom, with these we cups. Need more of them. Do we need different colors? Yeah. That could be exciting. Then I could make like a movie and I'd like build them and I'll build them so fast that I move so quickly it's a movie. Jeremy and I are getting ready to go out on a date night. We're going on a double date with his brother and our sister-in-law, so that's gonna be fun. I'm getting ready and I'm using my new mascara. Have you guys seen this? It's the Lash Next Door from Brooklyn and Bailey. So anyway, I'm enjoying it. Most importantly, I finally got my lab test results back and I do not have celiac disease. So Caleb is the only one in our family that tested positive for it. It is genetic, so that means that either Jeremy or I are a carrier. And it also means that any of the kids could develop it later on in their life. So we're still gonna keep watching them. But for now, we're feeling grateful that we can all just support Caleb in this and try to help him as much as we can. Good night, Jay House out. My name is Erin and I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. And I made my Harry Potter classroom. Zay us out. My name is Macy from Melbourne, Australia, and I made this mug. My name is Jess, I live in Australia, and I made this Jay house. <laughs> this is my dog, Luna. My name's Chloe, I'm from Indianapolis, Indiana, and me and my friend made these bracelets for, for a police officer who was sadly killed in the line of duty, and we raised over $1,000 for his family. Jay house out. Why do I need a harness? Going up in the sky, maybe.